Hey guys, I'm Caution Curve, and welcome to how to fix your action replay or if you have any problems with it, I'll tell you how to get codes on. So, when you bought your action replay, you should have got the action replay. Some little shitty USB cable. Doesn't even fit into a regular USB slot. And a CD. I already installed that software. So, I don't need that CD. So, I'll open up the software. It's right there. Yeah, you can work now. Okay, while that's loading up, I'm going to just go ahead and um, plug this into this. So just shove it in there. Yeah, it fits. And you're going to want to put this into your Nintendo DS. Not wrong way. Let me show you guys. Just like that. And I'll click right in. So if you put this, put your DS into your USB slot. Yeah, I already got the software opened up, you can see. If you saw there for a second or there, it said found new hardware, Nintendo DS cable link, I don't know. And this here, waiting for DS. There it is again. So even though it says it found new software, still doesn't show up. Now don't panic, because I figured out a way to put codes in without this piece of shit. Because you can just wait forever, and it will never show up. So what you want to do is just close... Whatever the hell this is, I don't even know. Oh wow. So then you're gonna wanna unplug. Get that out of there. You can keep the action replay in your DS, because that's what you'll need. Take this cable. Take this cable and chuck it. You'll never need it again. Now, take your DS. Turn it on. It should start by itself, right? Yeah. Okay, let me just get my stylus. Okay, so to get codes onto your action replay device, you're gonna go here and press that little starry shaped item. And then you'll get a list of games. I'm going to go to the game I have with me, which is Pokemon Diamond. Yeah. You just press that down thing. And it'll go all the way down. Until you find the game you want. Let me just do this myself. Just so you know, this does work. Because I've tried it. and it, I got, like... Rare candy cheats and master ball cheats and like shaman codes and stuff. And it doesn't mess up your DS like some rumors say. My DS and my my Pokemon Diamond game is perfectly fine. Okay, so I found Pokemon Diamond. But finally. You wanna press A and then here is a list of things. Let's see. These are codes I put in myself manually. Yeah, Suicune, Wild Chinese, Catch Other Trains, Pokemon, stuff like that. But you want to go on and go up here to where it says Add New Code. You're going to press A. So this, enter new code name. You enter whatever you want. Let's say Rare Candies or something, blah, blah, blah. No one really cares. You'll do that yourself. Press Next. 
right there. And it says enter new code. You're going to enter the code here. Don't worry, it doesn't take that long. I've done it many, many, many times. And it's totally worth it. Because it works. Hold on for a sec. Okay, now let's say I plugged in, let's say the NT code. I would go to it, press A, it'll have a little check mark. Then you're going to go to that backwards arrow, back, back again. And then there it will say insert game cart, cart here. So then you're going to want to do that, pop that shit out. And then put this Pokemon Diamond in. And now it should say Pokemon Diamond. Then you want to go to that little asterisk or star again. And then pick the code that you want. And say, oh, I don't really care, Mew. Then down here, it says start. You press start. Then up there, insert action replay. Go ahead and do that. Take that right out of there. Put that inside. Saving changes. Now it says insert game cart again. You take that out. Put that in once more. And it will start by itself. Just like that. Yep, and there you have it guys, that's how to get codes on your DS without that computer crap happening, and yeah, hope you enjoyed that, comment, subscribe, rate, see you guys later.